Live and learn. You ain't gon' learn if you don't go through it. Steady throwing shade, she got bullets when you go through ten. She playing blind to the fact that still ain't wanna see me then. Check the forecast, think whether you wanted to see me win. Both days, any place don't know shit. Bring them in. Host plate, ain't no talk none. They'd rather be the friend. Close things, promise was permanent. It's hard to sleep again. Do right. Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to Beat City Builds with your boy Ty. Oh uh, man, I got a fun one for you guys today. We got a little race, man, me and my boy. We, uh, we came out here to, uh, we're in Mexico. We came out here to Mexico Raceway. And uh, we have a little race for you guys today. Sheesh, gas versus, gas versus electric, yo. Got the Scott versus my boy's Tesla. Sheesh. I have I, I put up the specs for you guys. Look at that. And it used to, it's the what model three long range, right? Let's go. I don't know. I gotta do I gotta do a little research. I'll pull up the specs on the screen for you guys to see uh, what like the voltage and horsepower and the weight as well. You know, you guys know the scat is has a couple mods to it, nothing too much. You know, the last time I've been to a dyno, it put um like 470, but I was at the hub, you know, so it reads a little, a little higher, what, what, you know, when I put my wheels and stuff on. But um, yeah, man, we about to, we're out here in Mexico, Mexico Raceway, and we about to get a couple runs, and we're gonna do uh, we'll do, we'll probably do a couple from from a dig. We'll do a couple from a dig. Uh, see what happens there, and then we'll also uh, give some bonus races, give uh, get some roll races in there. You know what I mean? A little bonus roll races for you guys. But um, yeah, it should be a fun one. Like I said, uh, the only thing I'm worried about is uh, I mean, just like spinning a little bit. I do have some tire, I do have some tire tread left on these. I got a needle on this side. The other needle on the other side kind of went out already, so I had to go to my local tire shop got like a little tired but it still got a lot of meat it got more meat on this side but we should be good and i'll be using launch control and i'll be putting my shit on track you know like i'm, I'm gonna put all my goodies out. i'm gonna put all my goodies out because i'm gonna throw this out last time we did a little freeway roll a 60 he got me he, he got me pretty good it, it wasn't even that close either it, it wasn't even that close he kept pulling on me i have a little clip of it it's not too good the clip that i have but I, i'll probably throw it up Not, it's like not too much traffic out my plan was to like start at the green light and just have that green light be our go or we could just take one from right here and we'll just hunk it off from right here just to you know have one video going that way and then we'll come back you know what i mean yeah but um uh we'll kind of, let me just get a couple some footage of it oh yeah that's clean yo Sheesh. And what do you know what size rims these are? Twenties or what? Nineteens? Okay. And is, is it um like I said I I do some research, but do you know if it's rear wheel drive or all wheel drive? All wheel drive. Ooh, yeah, see. All wheel drive he, he might get me, yo. That's nice. The only thing I know is zero to sixty four point two seconds. Well, hold on, hold on. What do you say? You said zero to sixty what? Four point two seconds. I don't even and, know my zero to sixty time. And if I wanted to pay the extra two thousand, uh -huh. I'll bring it down to three point eight. Or yeah, so what is it? I'm pretty sure it's just like upgrading the battery. Like it would be a bigger battery in the no. in the. No, it's just fucking actually just just purchasing it and then it makes it go download. faster. That's it. Yeah. No so way. The capable. No way. This it's is capable. crazy. You hear that? He said that you could buy a two thousand dollar upgrade to make it go faster. They charge for everything nowadays. I mean, you guys are know that, but like, you know, it's, it's bullshit because it's capable of doing it's it. It's already, already, huh? You just gotta unlock yeah. it. You seen like the BMW is starting to do some shit like that too, right? Have you heard like they're nah, doing subscriptions or some shit? It's crazy, but um, yeah. yeah let's uh, I guess we'll get right into it. We'll we'll do one little race going down that way, but um, we'll try to do it from a dig. There's not too much traffic around this this Mexico Raceway area, but um, yeah, we're Mexico right now, man. We. We took the drive last night. We came out to Mexico. You know what I mean? Because we can't be doing no legal street racing in the U.S. You know what I mean? Not on my channel. No. 
we, we were driving out. We, we came down south of the border, and so let me just let me let me stop talking. Done. Let me stop talking, and let's let's do our first race. Let's get it. I'm in the whip right now. Let me turn it on track more real quick. Hop up in here. Let me put on launch real quick. Smoking or what? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Pull over, pull over. Why should overheating? Oh, I smell coolant. Oh no. I smell coolant. My shit over yeah, here. Come on, not again. What was it last time? Oh my god. No way, dude. What is it? What the fuck? Again. All my coolant's gone. What the fuck? What is it? It's the radiator. Fuck, didn't you just get a new one? That's what I'm saying. What's going on, YouTube? So, as you can see in the video, radiator busted again. What the fuck are we gonna do about this damn car? This radiator keeps fucking busting, right? So, uh, yeah, it was Sunday. I was racing with the homie. He has a Tesla Model 3 long range. Um, well, as you guys see in the video and we were gonna do like our second or third pool or something and uh and uh yeah i seen my temperature get at first first i seen smoke come from the hood i seen a little smoke come from the hood. oh what the fuck much is smoking and then i seen my temperature gauge go up you know past normal operating ranges so i'm like hold on let me pull over man she about to overheat Pulled over, as you can see in the video. Uh, you know, popped the hood, boom, coolant everywhere. Again, ready to bust the coolant over the floor, no more in my reservoir. So yeah, let's break it down real quick to uh, what the problems I had so far with this gap. Uh, I got it back in April of 2022. Everything was beautiful. Love the car, I still love the car, I don't get me wrong. But um, when I went to go install the Hellcat lower air box, uh, that's when I found the first leak, the hairline crack. I didn't see the crack, but there was, you know, I seen coolant leaking from the radiator. So, boom, took it in the first time. Uh, they did find the crack. They did replace the radiator. Uh, I did have to pay my deductible, which was 200 Uh So, did that. And then, uh, 
let's fast forward maybe like what a couple months like two months uh, i'm like all right well let's go to the dyno that's my first youtube video let's go to the dyno um went to the dyno everything was cool went the first two passes were great uh the third pass dang that's like the third time third time is just i, I should bust so the third the third pass in the dyno boom Rad, rad bust everywhere, cooling all over the floor of the shop, and and yeah, so boom, end up getting it. Same thing, got it back to the house. And that next Monday, took it to the dealer. Uh, they're like, yo, you know, what happened? What it seemed like to me, I don't know if you could seal, if they have like radiator sealant or something, but I don't know if they just sealed that crack and then it busted, but no, nah, they probably put a brand new radiator. I checked the brand new radiator, it looked brand new, so. Boom, they changed it out again. Uh, I didn't have the payload deductible that time because the radio didn't have warranty. So boom, they fixed it again. And then fast forward a month, about a month, this happened, what, last September? So fast forward one month and then I'm over here trying to race the fucking Tesla. And boom, she blows up again. So that's where I'm at. Uh, I just came back from the dealer. Uh, look what they busted me with though. They gave me a fucking SXT. The disrespect, right? But I'm just playing. I just came back from the dealer right now. Uh, shout out to my boy David at Glenny Thomas Dodge out here in uh, Signal Hill, California. Um, he's, he's been pretty good, pretty helpful. You know, uh, he told me, uh, yeah, this is going to be a third radiator. So I told him if he could check a few things for me. I mean, of course, for, you want to check the rad cap. Maybe the rad cap's not releasing pressure as it should. Uh, the next thing I was saying is maybe the thermostat's getting stuck or something, but he didn't. Uh, he told me that the check engine light would come on if the thermostat was getting stuck. So the check engine light hasn't hasn't came on. No check engine light hasn't came on. So the next thing would be a head gasket leak. So that's what they're gonna check for this time. They're gonna take off the heads, check the gaskets, and make sure there's no head gasket leak. That's probably what it is. I mean, um, one of, one of my friends did tell me that you could. You know, if the exhaust is sp spilling coolant, that's another way you could check. I haven't checked that yet, but um, that, so that that that's where we're at now. She's at the dealer. Uh, I don't want to. I mean, if it comes down to it, if it's a lemon, it's a lemon. Yeah, you know I mean, I'm a lemon it. Fuck it, you know. But if they figure out the problem this time, you know, it should be good. I didn't want to. I don't. I, sh I don't think I should have to get an upgraded radiator aluminum radiator because that, that's what i was really thinking i'm like damn should i just get a 180 thermostat and a radiator but i mean if the pressure's still building up in the, the rad maybe something else will burst you know so it's better if we just find out the situation before i even keep throwing money at it you know what i mean so that's where we're at now man that's where we're at now uh i miss her already but hopefully she's getting fixed they figure out the problem and no more busted radiators. No more busted radiators. So, um, thanks for watching again, man. Please, if you guys could subscribe, like, comment. Uh, drop a comment. What do you guys think it could be? Or what do you guys think I should do? Because, um, like I said, I went ahead to the car for six months. And I've already taken the back to the three times. Three times. Remember that old commercial? Um, man, remember that old commercial? You wouldn't have got a lemon from Toyo from something up for it I remember that shit once that happened I was like damn that fucking commercial I didn't think I was ever gonna get a lemon I'm like they don't make no lemons yeah they do maybe 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 just a head gasket maybe just a head gasket so hopefully they fix it everything's covered and we'll be good like again please if you can subscribe like leave a comment definitely helps the channel out um of course I'll be having some more prelude content coming you know what I mean I do have to fix the wheel hub assemblies on that, so we'll, we'll get that done. And, um, yeah, man, thanks for watching. Wish me luck with the scat because I'm going to need it, man. I'm going to need it. I'm going to need it. Thanks again for watching, guys. Subscribe. Beach City Builds.